welcome back to this Cricket Captain 2018 New Zealand Career Mode episode number four. Where today we're going to be taking on Sri Lanka in a test series. As we're going to continue here, skip ahead of time. We're going to see that the New Zealand domestics going to play a few games. And uh, here we are, we're going to go to the squad. But before we do, we are just going to take a look around the place. Okay, at the table, six games have been played, which is a good indicator for um, who we can pick. So, is there... Yes, here we go. We're going to go this year, runs. Ross Taylor's made the most runs. Tom Latham, Robbie O'Donnell, Fraser Colson. Okay. Glenn Phillips up there. Seen Solia. Sean Solia, sorry. Okay, how about wickets? Neil Wagner, Matt Henry, Jeet Patel, James Franklin? He's come back to New Zealand. He's 38 years of age, though. Matt Quinn. I have no idea what that means. I, I mean, it's not. I know it's Colpack, but does that mean he's eligible or not? Okay, he's from Gloucestershire. Alright, Dean Brownlee got the highest average. Apart from Matt Taylor, who. Okay, he's got 165. Five banning stars of form. Four and a bit. That looks very impressive, that graph. Not bad. Alright, let us get into our squad selection. So let's look at the squad. BJ Watling is out for three days. Okay, so he'll be back. He should be back in time. Oh, we can only pick 13, okay. If so, he's gone, he's out of form. Trent Bolt's out of form, that's no good. Uh, Saudi's out of form. Astle's out of form, he's gone. Anderson. A lot of these guys are out of form here. Jeepers, how are these guys so out of form? No wonder, just not scoring any runs at all. Chapman's actually in good form. Because he just scored a one day hundred. Okay, I might persist with him. Nichols, we're going to drop for now. Gaptal, we will drop for now as well. Worker, we'll think about dropping. How does he. He just scored a one day hundred as well. He is also playing. Okay, we might pick Josh Tasman Jones, maybe. BJ Watling is out for a little bit. A Jazz Patel's doing okay. Trent Bolt is not doing any good. He just took a four for the other day, though. Really struggling there, Bolty. Um, Alright, let's have a look around New Zealand. Who is el eligible for selection? Hamish Marshall. He's playing. He's not even playing like first class. Jeep Raval's no good. Craig's no. no we're looking for first class experience here. Oh, these are test match. Oh, that's why then. Okay. Current year. Uh. No. First class. There we go. Runs in the current year. Robbie O'Donnell and Fraser Colson might get a look. Oof, look at those big scores. What about O'Donnell? Both those guys might get a 
Get a go. Oh, Phillips is in prime form. He's only 21 as well. Just scored a one-day 100. Done okay in test matches. He's in form, though. Sean Solia. Wow. And his bowling. He provides a bit with the ball as well, eh? He's tempting. Dean Brownlee's tempting as well. I'm just going to add a bunch of guys and just um, then cut everyone back. Will Young is one of those guys that you'd think would make it up, but um, no, he's not in form at the moment. Josh Finney. Uh, kind of need more runs than that. He's in form, but he hasn't shown me enough, I don't feel. Ah, uh, so this is first test match of two against Sri Lanka. Okay. Sally and Bolt are out of form. Alright, let's see. Let's look at some wicket takers then. Oh, Patel has... Oh, right. He's retired. My bad. Hamish Bennett. Ben Lister. Ben Lister has no fitness. He's out for four days with a fracture. Bowlers don't have much form at the moment. Michael Ray's got some form. Five for thirty the other, the other week. Saudi's got no form. Ed Nuttall has okay form. Mitch McLeanigan has got some form. Karen Nathula. Jimmy Baker. Uh, not really. Okay, let's go with form. Form is always probably the better call to, to go on. So, a Jazz. Sorry, mate. I don't think we're going to need him as a spinner. Alright, we're going to send Trent Bolt back to domestic cricket. <laughs> oh, that is, that is one big blow, but see you, Bolty. Alright, let's do it. So we're going to give Physio to Latham and to Williamson. We're going to give a few guys defensive technique just to make sure that they're good for the season. Catching, catching. Good, and then we're going to give Williamson some defense. Colson some defense. Defense, no defense. I think we're good to go then. So Chat um, Chapman's not going to play, uh, and. Josh Tasman Jones is unlikely to play. They're both kind of backups to um, our opener and Ross Taylor. All right, let's do it. Here we go. All right, guys, here we are. We are three stars compared to their three and a half, so we are a little bit um, under a form, I guess. Um, I'm going to put that a lot down to... The fact that we've got three debutants and two guys that have played one game. So, yeah, actually we've got another debutant. Okay, this could be complicated actually. Yep, yeah, yep. Yeah. No. Phillips is keeping. King Williamson three. Ross Taylor four. Chapman. Five. I think Soli wants to bat three. You can't use Soli down here somewhere. So we've got five bowling options. That's kind of the idea. If we go Colson at five. 
Maybe we can go solely at five. Okay. Solly go at five, and then Colson at six, because I think Colson wants to go at six. I'm a little bit worried about the middle order. That's all I'm saying. What is he? Strong pace. It might even be better for him to go higher up because he'll face the new ball. And then Ross Taylor can. Although Ross Taylor's special is best, yeah. Colson, he's been specialist. Yeah, so he got everything covered, I think. Strong pace bowling. Cougar Lion is going to be there. Uh, we're going to get Hamish Bennett to open with Matt Henry. This is a brand new bowling attack here, guys. It's going to be super interesting. Okay. Got a few cloudy days, but looks like it's a bat first wicket. Just going to double check my team. Looks good to go, right? Let's go, guys. Here we go. We are fielding four debutants. Holy heck. That must that might be a New Zealand record. I'm not really sure, but they are not fielding a single one. They're fielding a pretty good team. So we're gonna go tails. We lost the toss. We're gonna bowl first. Would have liked to have batted first, unfortunately, but that's okay. That kind of gives us a chance to settle into our roles here. We're gonna go aggressive, of course, as we're going to put the highlights on low chances. Bennett to silver. Oh, there we go. Silver is bold for a 13 ball duck. What a good start. Bennett getting a wicket straight away. Matt Henry to Kushal Mendes. Oh! He's dropped. We dropped our own career mode. Unbelievable. Um, Neil Wagner going to come into Mendes. He's been hit for... Three fours, four fours in that over. What? Kushal Mendes ain't mucking round. Oh, and we've made a huge mistake. We've not picked a single spinner. Okay, Solia to Mendes. Gone. Bowled through the gate for 34-48. Uh, Wagner to Kunaratna. He's gone for 21 of 38. They are 73 for three. Wagner to De Silva. He's gone for a fireball duck. He's 77 for four hit. Solia to Matthews. Oh, swing and a miss. Oh, he's edged that down to fine league. That's the key wicket there, Angela Matthews. Let's try and get Scott Kugeline into the act. Wagner to Matthews. Swing and a miss again. Uh, we're going to bring Hamish Bennett back for a bit of a spell. Kugeline to Silva. He's nicked it and he's gone. Caught by Latham for one of 20. All over them here. And they are 105 for 5 at lunch. Alright. Hamish Bennett. We're going to bring Matt Henry back on. Matt Henry to Chandamal. Gone through the gate. 126 for 6. Henry to Harath. And that's a good shot. That will be 4. Almost 50 for Angela Matthews. So we're going to go a little bit more aggressive. Aggressive. Uh, a little bit more defensive on him. He's got 53 off 80. We'll play to him. We're going to bring Solia back on. Henry to Harat. Gone. LBW. 154 for 7 now. Solia to Chamera. Outside league and outside league. Uh, who else is taking wickets? Wagner's got two, so let's go with Wagner. Wagner got Chamera. He's got another. Wow, this is a good bowling display. 172 for 8 here. Wagner, nice oh, way, way down league. Don't know what he's appealing for that. Oh, Angela Matthews moves to 90 now. That's a name and a half, and he's LEW by Hamish Bennett. Wagner to Chimera, not Chimera, it's Kumara, sorry. And he's gone LEW. Angela Matthews is left stranded on 95, not out. As they are 206 all out. Alright guys, so this has given us a clear passage back into the game. Now we just need to go and bat 
that time, we got a lot of time. This is only T on day one here, so we got lots of time to settle in. Here we go. Chimera to Brownlee. Swing and a miss. Push Pakuma. Swing and a miss. All right. 50 opening stand for these two batsmen. Good stuff. Harath to Brownlee. He's nicked it into the ground. And that is the end of day one, guys. 66 without loss. What a good start. They lead by 140, but we have to restart, unfortunately. But here we are on day two. It's looking okay. Day three is... Day three and four is kind of where it gets a little bit patchy. Harath to Brownlee. Ooh, swing and a miss. Oh, stumped. Is it gone? Stumped for 47 of 121. The first wicket finally fallen. Chimera to Latham. He's missed it. Need to settle in for the day and then we'll be sweet. Latham has passed another 50. He's been in form this entire cremo, guys. That is his 19th Test Match 50. It's been an absolute gun for us so far. Push Pakumara. Almost bowls Kane Williamson there. Not to be. As we're pushing towards lunch here. Lunch on day two. We are 154 for one. Really putting the gas down now. Harath to Latham. Ooh. It's spinning a little bit. Push Pakumara to Kane Williamson. Swing and a miss. Caught behind a peel, but not out. Harath to Latham. Outside the line. Push Pakumara. He pushes, he runs. Can he get in? Not out, and he's brung up his 50. Kane Williamson with a tight single there. It's now very cloudy. Sri Lanka have taken the new ball. And Kane Williamson's cleaned up by a butte. Taylor. He can't get in. One off four. It's very cloudy at the moment. We need to stick around. And that's T on day two. Tom Latham goes to T on 98. Can he bring up the ton? You bet he can. Let's look at the ton here. There you go. He's brung up the ton. Uh, that is his seventh test match century of almost 300 balls. It's taken his time. But now we can really put the gas down as heading into day three. It is super cloudy, but we do lead in the first innings. That is the important part. Rain has stopped play, though. 59 minutes have been lost. Oh, dear. Sets our momentum back to the beginning, really. Push Pakumara to Solia. Ooh, swing and miss. Push Pakumara. End of day two. We lead by 36 runs. The weather is just not on our favour at the moment. But every run we can get will be beneficial in the long term. If we could try and put a big lead on here, it'd be good. Harath to Solia. Missed. Push Bakumara to Solia. Outside the line. Harath to Solia. Oh, yes it is. Oh, hang on, hang on, hang on, hang on. Is that not pitched outside leg? How is that not... Oh... Um, struck in line. Oh, I'm going to say that's marginal call. But uh, either way, Solly's gone for 34. 
We lead by 59. Colson in on his test match uh, debut here. Lunch on day three. We lead by 104 runs. Really good stuff by the New Zealanders. Such a different team already from the Pakistan batting innings that we've had. 310 for four. And with 100 lead. Haraf to Latham. He's on 146. Haraf to Latham. Oh, he's gone though. Finally dismissed for 146. What a knock that has been though. We lead by 122. Now we need to start putting the gas down. We got Phillips to do it. Can he? Can he do it though? Yes, it's a swing and miss. Raff to Phillips again. That's a beaut. Yeah, got it. Just grip and turn, and Phillips is gone. Good. Harath is getting this ball to grip. Not good signs for our batsman. Oh, because we do not have a spinner in the team. Sri Lanka take the new ball. And Colson has brung up his test match. His maiden test half century, if I can speak the words. Getting 51 in his first game. So that's good stuff by him. T on day three. We lead by 187 runs. It's very cloudy again for the next two sessions. I think we should just put the gas down, honestly, and go for it. Although, actually, I think we could as many runs as we can get. Karuna Ratner's bowling? Oh, he's got a wicket too! Oh, would you believe it? Oh, Henry, mate. That's a shot. Oh, he's gone for 82, Colson. Well played to him, though. As now we just need to eke out as many rounds as we can and go out there and bowl them out. What day is it? Day three. Oh, we've got plenty of time, I think. It's not really no rain, so... We're nine down now. Swing and miss. I'm just going to put them up. Have a bit of a swing, lads. There we go. Hamish Bennett's gone for 20 off 20. We're all out for 4, 4, 6. And we lead by 240 runs right now. With the very cloudy conditions behind our backs, we will go out there. Here we go. There you go. In the first over, Bennett has got a beauty to bowl Karuna Ratner. Matt Henry at the other end. Here we go. Bennett. Oh, Bennett's given Mendes an LBW shout and is gone. Oh, swing and miss. Cow. Yes! What a catch! I thought it was gone over his head. Angelo Matthews has gone for a seven ball duck. That's a massive wicket. Alright, we've lost play at the end of that day there. Cool. Harath has took a five though in that last thing, didn't even realise. Alright, and already Hamish Bennett's on three for 11, and they're 24 for three. He's nicked and he's gone! Brownlee takes the catch. They're 24 for four here. Make that 24 for five. This is an amazing bowling spell here. He's gone! Phillips takes the catch. Bennett gets Chanamal for a 10 ball duck and picks up his five for five for 12. Unbelievable bowling here. Sri Lanka are 34 for seven. He's nicked. Oh, Phillips couldn't get that one. All right, let's get someone else on to take some wickets here. Outside leg. Nicked. Oh, Phillips has put another one down. Phillips, man. Damn it, Phillips. Oh, he's gone. He is gone. Here we go. Cougar line. Gets that breakthrough as well. He gets the big breakthrough. Now we need to clean him up. Oh, swing and miss. 
Let's get uh, Bennett back on. Bennett can try and finish it off. No. Yes! Bennett finishes it off, and we win by an innings and 174 runs. Guys, what a performance it has been today after taking ages to select the team and ending up with four debutants in the team. We've won by an innings and 174 runs. Bennett getting man of the match for 6 for 20. He took 8 for in the match. 8 for 57. That is amazing. Latham getting 146. Colson getting 82. Williamson getting 50. Solia getting 34. And a few starts from the other debutantes as well. Phillips had a few drop catches behind the stumps, but overall still took a decent amount of catches. He did drop three catches, though, and that kind of worries me. But, look, we won by an innings in 174 runs, guys. We lead the Test Series 1-0. And that is a very good start um, to our home summer. It's said we have no stars. <laughs> it's like, no stars. No stars for you. Um, otherwise, guys, if we just quickly take a look at the world ratings... In our performance uh, against Sri Lanka, our last home series, we won 2-0. And the away series, we drew. So we need to win it, the away series. This one, the home series, we just need to win now. And we will keep those points, which is vital. Otherwise, guys, that is the end of today's episode. Please, if you did enjoy this episode, guys, leave a like. Subscribe for more content such as this. And I will see you all in the next test match, guys. Goodbye for now.